Welcome to the National Archives. This video discusses how to handle volumes. Volumes in archival collections can vary widely in their age, size, construction, condition and materials. Each of these factors can affect how susceptible a volume is to damage during use, but through good document handling we can better protect our collection now and for the future. While every volume is unique, vulnerable areas can include the covers or boards of volumes, the joint between the covers and the spine, the spine and sewing structure, particularly where the spine of volume has become loose, the sewing structure which, if damaged, can lead to loose pages that can easily move or fall out. Good document handling involves protecting and supporting documents while you use them. When handling any archival document it's important to take your time, to pay attention to vulnerable areas, to have clean hands and to think about the space, assistance and handling aids needed. To protect volumes during use, please remember 1. Volumes may be housed in tight-fitting boxes. To safely remove a volume from a tightly fitting box, first remove the lid, then carefully turn the volume and box base over together onto the tabletop. Remember to support the volume throughout. 2. Open volumes only as far as you can without forcing them, and they should never be laid flat on a table surface. 3. Always use support with volumes. Use book wedges, flat pads or book cushions to raise and angle the volume and, where necessary, to support the spine, particularly the join between the spine and the covers. 4. Use a spine support for paperback volumes or any volume where the spine cover is loose or missing. 5. Turn pages slowly being mindful of any tears or folds that could catch on other pages. Six, if necessary, place snake weights across the corners of the pages to hold them gently in place, avoiding areas of text. Bag or glass weights are not suitable as they may slide down an angled page and cause damage. Seven, Avoid touching the printed surface of the page. Use a paper marker to follow the text instead of fingers. 8. Check your supports regularly as you move through a volume and make adjustments as needed to make sure the volume is properly supported. Nine, ask for assistance if you're having difficulty safely handling a volume. Some volumes are oversized and difficult to handle. As with all archival documents, please return your documents in the same condition as you received them. And if you have any questions, our reader support team will be happy to help at any time.